Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to One Piece. We're reacting to One Piece episode 987. Uh, like I said last week, I don't know how I'm going to do the, the chapters that I missed. Uh, let me know what you guys want me to do. Uh, if you want me to, to just like do a review on all and everything up until. Or do like a bulk chapter recording uh, reaction of a bunch of the chapters. Uh, I think I missed like four to five. No, I missed more than that. I, I didn't upload for like two months. But anyway, uh, we're back for 987. Last week, I did. you guys did tell me in the comment section... Uh, that the episode was outsourced, which is why it looked and felt so different. I personally love the way, like, how different and, like, how much character a lot of the, like, movements and stuff has. So I really liked the, the way it was last week. But regardless of the preload or the video with audio of the copyright strikes, and let's get into it. Okay, yeah, Kid, now Kid looks a little bit more like himself. But yeah, he, he fucking stiff-armed the shit out of, out of Hawkins with that punk Gibson. Oh, I guess I have my subtitles were on. Hold up. Alright, alright, all right, good. Oh my god, dude. Bro, bro the music is bumping. A kid is just stiff arming the shit out of a poo still, dude. I think this is Stampede music, I'm sure. I love that they've been using the Stampede music in this arc so far. Wait, how did his out? How did his outfit come undone? He didn't take it off. It's supposed to be that he takes it off and then his normal outfit comes back, right? But he didn't take it off. I mean, whatever. It doesn't matter anyway since he got exposed. But uh, the only thing I don't want from this episode is please, Toei, you've been doing great, but no, no more, no more Tama flashback. And he see that, like I'm, <laughs> I'm done with that little flashback. Please. Bro, my boy, I, I'm not even gonna say Apu because I don't my boy because I don't like Apu that much. But he's low diffing all of them, bro. You hate to see it. What the hell? What was that? I've never seen that move from Apu before. He like opened his hand and like his. Ew, that was gross. Oh, there goes Panda Man. Of course, Panda Man's a traitor and working with Kaido, bro. You hate to see it. Ooh, I like that effect, dude. I I was wondering how they were gonna do kids like powers, right? Because it's just magnetism, right? Um, where that's the power he has, uh, which is very strong power, you know, Magneto or whatever. But if you think about, like, the like when they first showed him in, like, Shabondi, like, you didn't really see much effects, right? Obviously, back then. I mean, I know Wano right now is crazy with effects anyway, but seeing the way they're handling kids, like, like the way they're showing his powers, I, I like it. Like, the radio waves, kind of, like, purple electricity... Uh, they were even using like the electricity sound effect that you know Toei's famously used for like Dragon Ball and stuff. Uh, but I really, really do like the way that they're handling kids' stuff. I, I really like it. A oh boy rocking the Kill Bill fit. Okay, I respect it. Whoa, you can see Killer's arm. It's like really messed up. It's like burnt. I didn't. I never noticed that. I never noticed Killer's arm being like that. Like burn, like like distorted. Oh, there goes this power. Yeah, distorted. Yeah, bro. Hot shot. I think you're over your head a little bit. Oh my god. Cool. It's at least cool seeing kids crew doing other stuff because like the only one we know a lot of is really killer, right? Mm. 
you can kind of see uh kids like unwillingness unwillingness to be like with like luffy and stuff i i, I think obviously it's because of you, a lot of people can chalk it up oh he's just stubborn he's a hard-headed guy or whatever i kind of like looking a little bit deeper and i think it's a little obvious obviously like i'm not a genius or nothing but it's pretty cool that like it's basically because he let me move my mic a little bit it's basically because he has such a bad experience with, you know, with uh, Drake and all of them, right? Or not even Drake, uh, Apu and stuff, right? So to him, it's like, yeah, no, I'm done with alliances, bro. So it's cool kind of seeing him kind of fit into the mold a little bit more slowly, but surely as this part of the arc goes on, uh, while working together with Luffy and them. Jesus, kid's arm, or not kid. Also, even uh, Killer is kind of, yeah. His arm is disgusting looking, Jesus. Damn, man, why, why uh, I guess it makes sense Apu is the one with a cool power like this, but he's so annoying, man. So if you cover your ears, that's like the weakness to his ability, which is kind of it's kind of funny that you just have to plug your ears and not listen. Now Big Mom's crew showing up, bro. She don't know. Wait, she don't know what a port is, but she owns like an entire country essentially. There goes Paris Sparrow. Which, by the way. I think it's really cool when uh, Devil Free users use their ability to, like, replace a limb or something. I think that's really cool because, like, obviously for, like, Aokiji in Film Z, you learn that he, like, replaces, I think, like, his leg. Uh, I don't think his arms, though. He just has scars. Uh, I, I think I don't think his arm anyway. But anyway, uh, then we have Perospero here, like, replacing his uh, hand, looks like, with a candy hand. I think that's really cool. Oh my lord. They they they're really emphasizing on carrot now, huh? Chinova. I'm <laughs> I'm behind. Dude, it is wild how badly time has treated Shinobu. <laughs> it is wild, man. Whatever. <laughs> of course. Yo, but Haiki, wait, she just asked all of them. I don't know if it's probably for the ploy, but she just asked all of them they want to have some fun after they defeat Kaido or whatever. What, what, she, what, what was she trying to get into, bro? I mean, if she was younger Shinobu, they would have accepted, so like... Well, what was she trying to get into there? <laughs> Sanji, he is so down bad, he was thinking, maybe I should try that. <laughs> no, no ball crushing, dude. Oh, Sanji, 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 Sanji. Why was he? Bro, what was. No, okay, that animation looked lazy, but also super funny because of that. Like, it, like, dragged in, like, a PNG. That was funny. I mean, they did it on purpose, I think. My man had, like, three. Like, he was doing the freaking. Uh... Oh, like, was it, like, the, the Akuma death move, bro? Bro, yeah. You have Nami and Carrot right next to you. Oh my god, he looks so depressed. Oh my god. Uh, 
I was gonna say, is it really a smart idea to piss off the guys that's literally tearing through the entire like building so right now? Dude, I love who's who's color scheme, dude. The red suit is popping with the pink hair. Oh shit, okay. Well that was the episode. Um this episode I think was like probably the least hype I've been in in a little bit. Not because it wasn't it was okay. I think uh the pacing in this one was really slow. Uh it really felt stagnant. Like we like I know we pretty much got info on like where uh Nami and the rest of them are at, but literally aside from that, it kinda just I don't know, felt very stagnant. And I think the Apu part in the manga too for me just I could not, I, 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 not that I didn't care, but I felt like that part dragged me because I guess I, because I don't like Apu too much that like, it kind of felt like it was dragging because it was a little annoying seeing him like same thing, slice, like it, it gets kind of tiresome when it repeats itself a little bit too much. Um, but no, this, this episode was okay. It was, eh. it's very slow though, much slower paced than last week and not really any cool standout moments in my opinion. Right. But we did get plot uh, a little bit of plot progression, so it was okay. Uh, art was at least okay. Uh, everything else was okay, at least animation art-wise. But nothing, like I said, stand out or crazy. So with all that being said, hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe, and share the video if you enjoyed. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.